Some are calling it a business move with a backbone. Google has decided to pull out of Beijing over the country's censorship rules. China has an estimated 350 million internet users, and many internet searchers use Beidou.com, Google's chief rival. The government has already shut off YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter. Flowers and candles placed on a company sign at Google's Beijing headquarters, resembling a memorial. It appears Google is quitting China. This is about a question of censorship, and it's a question of still trying to give the Chinese users the most possible information. Uncensored. The censorship issue came to head when the internet giant shut down Google Inc. in Beijing, and began redirecting internet users to an uncensored portal in Hong Kong. Google's decision shifts the responsibility for censoring from Google to the communist government. Well, when we made the announcement that we intended to lift uh, censoring uh, in January, we we hoped to speak to the Chinese government at, at, at that point, and we did we did uh, have discussions with the Chinese government. They made it very very clear that it wouldn't be possible to uh, lift the censorship of results in China within the law, and therefore we've come up with this uh, alternative solution, which we think is a, a good solution and which is、uh, completely legal. China officials have called the move totally wrong, accusing Google of violating promises. For Google supporters in China. I hope that not only the company returns, but that it also ushers in a new way of doing business. And it remains to be seen the impact of Google's decision. China maintains the Google action is just a business move and will not affect overall U.S. and China relations. Melissa Sardelli, Eyewitness News.